First John 2.15 says, Love not the world, neither the things that are in the world. If any man love the world, the love of the Father is not in him. For all that is in the world, the loss of the flesh, the lust of the eyes, the pride of life, is not of the Father, but is of the world. And the world passeth away, and the lust thereof, but he that do the will of God abide forever. Little children, it is the last time. And as you have heard, that Antichrist shall come. Even now are there many Antichrists. Thereby we know that it is the last time. Ladies and gentlemen, we live in, in the world of Satanism. In plain sight, right in front of you. Do not be amazed. Television were only created to tell you their vision. People, I have told you in the past, they all in the same club. There's no hero. Christians love nothing more than to see suffering so they can go and whine and moan over it and help people and feel how good they are that they're helping people. And as we move into the satanic century, we're going to see Christianity's last gasp. Hate is necessary in a controlled way just as much as love is necessary. They're all in the same club. Don't fall for them. Don't buy their CDs. When they're throwing up the devil's horn, it does not mean love. They're giving allegiance to their master, their god, Satan. King Diamond. How much can you influence kids? I think people are too clever to be influenced by watching a band or listening to an album to go out and do the same. All these symbols and signs, people, they mean something. You have to watch what your children are watching on television. The plan of the devil is to spoil your kids, to make them become like Satanism in the last days. Watch those symbols and signs. They are not per chance, nor per coincidence. It's all the plans of the devil. Destroying the minds of the children so they can become Satanists. 2 Peter 2.20 For if after they have escaped the pollutions of this world, through the knowledge of the Lord and Savior Jesus Christ, they are again entangled therein, and overcome the latter, and, and, and is worse with them than the beginning. For it had been better for them not to have known the way of righteousness, than after they have known it, to turn from the holy commandment delivered unto them. But it has happened unto them, according to the true proverb, the dog is turned to his own vomit again, and the soul that was washed to her wallowing in the mire. I wouldn't say I drank blood. Uh, a lick. These are your favorite rappers and celebrities, folks. They're all in the same game, playing you out. There's no heroes but only Jesus Christ. All these people are lost into Satan's hands. And if they don't repent, sadly, they all will perish in hell. Second Peter 3, starting at verse 2, that you may be mindful of the words which were spoken before the holy prophets and of the commandments of us, the apostles of the Lord and Savior, knowing this first, that there shall come in the last days scoffers walking after their own lusts and saying, where is the promise of his coming? For since the father fall asleep, all things continue as they were from the beginning of the creation. For this they willingly are ignorant of, that by the word of God, the heavens were of old and the earth standing out of the waters and in the waters, whereby the world that then was 
being overflowed with waters, perish. But the heavens and the earth, which are now by the same word, are kept in store, reserved unto fire against the day of judgment in perdition of ungodly man. Come out. I won't let her go. No. So Hunter Thompson approached you about doing a snuff film? Yep. Okay. He offered me $100,000 to shoot a snuff film, and I wouldn't do it. I, I did say snuff film. That's where they would have... They would sell the tape to these wealthy business people for tremendous amounts. How much can you influence? That's what our televisions have done to us. They've gotten us to a frame of mind that we do not realize the real world around us. People... People in this day and age are brainwashed and programmed like a computer at being nothing more than puppets. Beloved, be not ignorant of this one thing that one day is with the Lord as a thousand years. In a thousand years as one day. The Lord is not slack concerning his promise as some men count slackness. But is long suffering to us word not willing that anyone should perish. But that all should come to repentance. But the day of the Lord will come as a thief in the night, in which the heavens shall pass away with a great noise, and the elements shall melt with fervent heat. The earth also, and the works that are therein, shall be burned up. I've been trying to tell you guys that for years, everything has been rigged, totally 100% controlled by the Freemasons, by the secret society. All these signs and symbols, they mean something. Now, these are your favorite celebrities that you are supporting. When all is said and done, to keep millions of people alive who are not ever going to be productive, who are going to drain all of our resources and create a stagnant world. First Corinthians 6, 9, and 10. Know ye not that the unrighteous shall not inherit the kingdom of God? Be not deceived, neither fornicators, nor idolaters, nor adulterers, nor effeminate, nor abusers of themselves with mankind, nor thieves, nor covetous, nor drunkards, nor revilers, nor extortioners shall inherit the kingdom of God. And such were some of you, but you are washed, but you are sanctified, but you are justified in the name of the Lord Jesus and by the Spirit of our God. 1 Corinthians 6, 9-11 You a demon? No, but I have demonic energy. Oh, I may be a demon. I don't know. You tell me. As they do these things, they break down all the barriers holding the devil back. And just literally, they become a human chalice. They fill up with demons. Because there's a bunch of devil weapons in that house. It doesn't matter if you believe in Satan. It doesn't matter if you believe in demons. What's important is to know that there are people out there that do. And they're willing to do anything to accomplish their goal. Satan to me would be God. I was just born a witch. Consciousness without a body. Moloch who burns down the love of the world. Woke up in Moloch. 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 Crowley taught that the way you could live forever was by vampirizing little children sexually. Hitler was a masterful black magician. A witch. As they do these things, they break down all the 
with barriers holding the devil back. And just literally, they become a human chalice. They fill up with demons. This is, uh, Zena, this is your father's book, the Satanic Bible. I mean, this is it. This is the diatribe of the devil that uh, has brought together thousands of people in your belief system. Mm -hmm. I dip my forefinger in the watery blood of your impotent mad redeemer and right over his thorn torn brow. matching tattoo with another celebrity, Marilyn Manson. Marilyn has told us himself. He said, Johnny Depp is like a brother to me. We have matching tattoos. Romans 1 verse 18. For the wrath of God is revealed from heaven against all ungodliness and unrighteousness of men who hold the truth in unrighteousness. On our backs. It's a kind of secret. People say, why did you get that? And we say, no reason, no reason, no reason. Anybody that come on television must be an initiated witch. You can just check them off. It's a case so stunning, so controversial, it became a major cause celeb. You can just check them off. It's a case so stunning, so controversial, it became a major cause celeb. With actors and musicians like Johnny Depp, the Dixie Chicks' Natalie Maines, and Pearl Jam's Eddie Vedder. And I'm also here to show my support for the West Memphis Three. The celebrities fighting for the teen's release claimed the kids were railroaded because of their mullets, dark clothes, and fascination with the occult. anybody home up there it's done in secret the same bible that says sodomy is illegal in god's kingdom but that's, it, but it's so that's much, the bible but it's so much fun yeah the gods must have kind of some dark sense of humor keep him around this long Johnny's life, Hunter S. Thompson. Johnny became friends with Thompson before he filmed Fear and Loathing in Las Vegas. It was a friendship that endured for years. Your doctor is what? What, a, what area, what discipline are you a doctor in of? Hunter got his doctor degree from the Universal Life Church. This will be the first, I believe, same-sex wedding ever performed on late-night television. Best of all, I am going to officiate the wedding myself. By the power vested in me by the state of New York and the Universal Life Church Monastery. Hunter got his doctorate degree from the Universal Life Church. The Universal Life Church Monastery. You guys don't understand what's going on in this world. All these people in television are working for the devil. There's no way you're going to make it on top if you don't sign your contract. Give your soul to the devil in order for you to be famous. In order for you to make a lot of money. There's no free ride. There goes your celebrities, people. Wake up. You gotta understand, okay? Satan is not an idiot. We have before us the opportunity to forge for ourselves and for future generations a new world order. Jimmy Shumble, Tom Rosenthal. Ah, now look around and say. 
is not what you think you know. <laughs> the forces of darkness are at work there. <laughs> There you go, folks. The whole plan of Satan, TV, Hollywood, music industry, the whole plan is to pollute your mind away from the true gospel of Jesus Christ so that you can end up in hell with the devil. For nothing is hidden that will not be made manifest, nor is anything secret that will not be known and come to light family shut off the tv get rid of your cable stop supporting the wicked and fall in love with jesus christ if you have not given your life to the lord jesus christ now this is the best time because there's the day coming where there are going to be a lot of falling away from the gospel and many right now are already sold out to the kingdom of darkness even though you see them on the pulpit, they are not preaching the gospel of Jesus Christ. If they were, they would have encouraged these people to come closer to God and to forsake their sins. Anyone that is not preaching against sin, against Satanism, against the system of this world, they are not teaching them to fear God. These pastors are all sold out. They are all sold out to the devil. They are nothing but an organization that's making money. In the name of God, God bless, subscribe, share.